Welcome to Fees Fight Pack Day 17. It was a really hard day today and a lot of me being emotional and talking through the last few days. It's Friday morning, which means it's my morning, which is just a very difficult morning for me. I've been up since like 4am, very anxious, but um, I got my porridge, um, got a teaspoon that says you got this. Um, so I just need to keep going, keep focused, and just keep breathing. <laughs> I think yesterday was such a big day with the meeting um, and whilst I've made so much progress I think we all recognised that I need more time to consolidate that progress before making another huge big change um, with my eating but also with thinking about going home and obviously that's you know going to bring its own challenges um, so the plan's effectively just been delayed. Um, I can still go home, which is the most important thing to me. Um, but I think they, it was a very ambitious plan um, and they have adjusted it to be more realistic. Um, it was a very hard conversation to have and I feel like I've disappointed myself and I've disappointed other people, but equally I understand. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been a, a lot of information to take in. Just now sitting down to my apple, my little Grinch bowl. Just sitting down to my yogurt again. Um, very anxious again um, but I did the last two so I know I can do this one as well um, Christmas teaspoon ready I've got my protein bar um, I'm really anxious not just because it's the bar again but because um, it's a bigger bar than what I have been having, um, which just makes it a bit more challenging. Um, but we'll just, we'll get through it. <laughs> Put it on my Christmassy plate, just needed some Christmas sparkle in my life. halfway through my bar and I was just thinking like it's just a bar like it, I build this thing up in my head or I don't the illness does and it's just a bar that anyone can eat and why can I not have it like I didn't let myself have this one because it's one of my favorite bars but I'm like depriving myself for what? When am I, when is my eating disorder ever gonna let me have it? And it's been on my mind all morning and I felt like I needed permission to have it. But at the end of the day, I can't let the anorexia keep on not letting me have things. And it's like with the drinks as well, like, I deserve to be able to drink what I want, I deserve to be able to eat what I want to eat. I even feel like ill saying that, but I think it's going to take a long time to reprogram the way my brain works. And it is that like self-punishment and that like I don't deserve things, which is why I need to keep eating things like this, because it is just about, but it's also about 
letting myself have something that I actually want and saying that and not being scared of that. He did it again. Mum's come to rescue me, I'm going on leave. It's been a really, really hard afternoon. Um, I think the anxiety of all, like going back onto feeds hit me and we went on leave, me and mum, and it wasn't very wheelchair friendly and I felt so self-conscious of being in the wheelchair. Um, and I just felt awful. I felt so humiliated and so ashamed and it was really difficult to push me anywhere because the roads were really uneven and people kept looking at me and I'm just tired of people looking at me and I'm frustrated because I feel like everything has gone backwards even though I know it hasn't and we're still moving forwards but we just need to move forwards in a different way and I just burst into tears when we were out and I just feel really low and just horrible. I just wouldn't wish this situation on my worst enemy. I wouldn't wish this illness on my worst enemy. It just... It's just horrible. And I want to beat it more than anything. It's just absolutely exhausting fighting it 24 seven. And I'm trying to be positive and I'm trying to keep doing what I need to do. But I'm just exhausted of it. Uh, I'm just having a bad day. I'm having an overwhelmed day. I'm really nervous about going back onto an overnight feed. Um, like the anorexia in my head is loud. I'm worried about it affecting my sleep. Um, and also a morning feed again, on top of an increase on my meal plan. It's just very overwhelming. I wouldn't wish this hell on my worst enemy. I really wouldn't. As the slide says, kinda had a breakdown. I was going to start this video by saying it's been a tricky evening, but then I saw my reflection and thought, yeah, it's been a tricky evening. It's been a tricky day. Wow, I look shocking. Um, it's been hard. I don't really know what to say other than despite it being hard, I've stuck to my meal plan which I'm kind of proud of myself for, but also feel horrifically guilty for. Um, yeah. It's been an extremely difficult day, afternoon, evening, morning. Um, but it's six o'clock, well it's actually half six now because I had a shower and tried to be kinder to myself. Uh, so I've got my Be Brave teaspoon and I'm still gonna have my six o'clock food, despite the fact I feel horrendous about it. Sad snack, currently. I've edited this bit where I spoke about what medication I was given just in case it triggered anyone. Um, but I was given some extra PRN to help calm down before the feed was set up. And feeling much calmer about them setting my feed up, which is a good thing. My feed got put up and I took my evening meds and went to bed. I still feel a huge amount of guilt over the feed, but I just kept going. And as always, finishing on a positive quote.